Have you ever wondered why during a solar eclipse day turns into night? What if I told you that this celestial magic, this dance of the sun and moon, is more than just a spectacle? It's a phenomenon that has fascinated humanity for millennia, a ballet of shadows and light that has sparked scientific curiosity and inspired countless myths. As we stand on the brink of the upcoming April 8, 2024 solar eclipse, are you ready to dive into this cosmic journey? Stay tuned as we unravel the mysteries of solar eclipses. A solar eclipse is a celestial event that occurs when the moon lines up between the sun and the earth. This alignment, known as syzygy in astronomical terms, creates a fascinating spectacle for us earth dwellers. Now you might be wondering, why don't we see a solar eclipse every new moon? Good question, it's all about the tilt. The moon's orbit around the earth isn't exactly in line with earth's orbit around the sun, it's tilted by about 5 degrees. So, during most new moons, the moon is either a bit above or below the line between the Earth and the Sun. Only when the orbits align just right do we get to experience the spectacle of a solar eclipse. So, what exactly happens during a solar eclipse? As the moon moves in between the Earth and the Sun, it gradually blocks the Sun's light. This happens in stages. First, there's the partial eclipse, where the moon starts to creep over the Sun's disk. Then, if you're in the right place at the right time, you'll experience the total eclipse where the moon fully covers the sun. The day turns into night, temperatures drop and stars become visible in the sky. Now, it's important to remember that looking directly at the sun, even when it's partially obscured by the moon, can cause serious eye damage. So if you're planning to watch a solar eclipse, make sure you use proper solar viewing glasses. Finally, let's touch upon the duration of a solar eclipse. From start to finish, the process can last from a couple of hours to a few minutes, depending on your location and the type of the eclipse. The longest a total solar eclipse can last at any point along its path is seven and a half minutes, but this is extremely rare. In the words of the great Carl Sagan, astronomy compels the soul to look upwards and leads us from this world to another. So, are you ready to step into another world with the upcoming solar eclipse? Solar eclipses come in three flavors, total, partial, and annular. Now let's dig into these cosmic phenomena a bit more. Total solar eclipses are the headliners, the rock stars of celestial events. They occur when the moon completely obscures the sun, casting a shadow that transforms day into twilight. For a fleeting moment, the sun's outer atmosphere, the corona, becomes visible as a shimmering halo. It's a sight that has left many an observer spellbound. Then we have partial solar eclipses. These are the shy cousins of total eclipses. During a partial eclipse, the moon only partially covers the sun, creating a fascinating crescent-shaped light. The amount of the sun covered varies from event to event, but even a small coverage can create a striking image. Finally, let's meet the annular eclipse, the celestial illusionist. In this case, the moon is at a point in its orbit where it appears smaller than the sun, as it moves across the sun, it leaves a bright ring of sunlight visible creating what's known as the ring of fire. It's a spectacle that dazzles in its own unique way. Each of these solar eclipses occurs under very specific conditions. For a total eclipse, the moon must be close enough to Earth to appear large enough to cover the sun entirely. For partial and annular eclipses, the moon's distance from Earth and its alignment with the sun are key. To quote noted astrophysicist Neil deGrasse Tyson, the universe is under no obligation to make sense to you. Yet, the predictable dance of these celestial bodies allows us to anticipate these events with remarkable accuracy. Total solar eclipses like the one we're anticipating on April 8, 2024, are particularly special. They offer us a rare opportunity to witness the sun's ethereal corona and experience a few minutes of daytime twilight. In essence, total eclipses are the universe's way of reminding us of our place in the grand cosmic ballet. Each type of solar eclipse is a unique spectacle, a marvel of the cosmos. Observing a solar eclipse is a thrilling experience, but it is crucial to do it safely. Let's dive into the dos and don'ts of solar eclipse viewing. First and foremost, always protect your eyes. The sun's rays can cause serious damage even during an eclipse. Never look directly at the sun without appropriate solar filters or eclipse glasses. Regular sunglasses, no matter how dark, are not enough protection. It's best to use solar viewers or eclipse glasses that meet the ISO 12312, 2 international standard for such products. These are designed to filter out all harmful rays. When using them, make sure there are no scratches or damages that could let in unfiltered sunlight. If you're planning to photograph the solar eclipse, remember that your camera needs protection too. 
The sun can damage the sensor, so use a solar filter on your camera lens. And remember, it's not safe to look at the sun through an unfiltered camera viewfinder. Now let's talk about what not to do. Never look at the sun through binoculars, a telescope, or any optical device while using your eclipse glasses or solar viewer. The concentrated solar rays can damage the filter and enter your eyes, causing serious injury. Avoid using homemade filters or ordinary sunglasses, even very dark ones. They transmit thousands of times too much sunlight. Also, don't spend all your time trying to capture the event on your camera or phone. Experience the eclipse with your own eyes, with the right protection of course. It's a rare celestial spectacle worth soaking in. If you're watching with children, keep a close eye on them to make sure they're using their solar viewers correctly. Teach them about the importance of eye safety during a solar eclipse. So, to sum it up, use proper eye protection, avoid unsafe practices, and make the most of the moment. As renowned physicist and solar eclipse enthusiast Jay Pasichoff said, an eclipse is a cosmic billiard shot. The sun, the moon, and earth line up to reveal the sun's atmosphere, its corona. Remember safety first as we cherish these spectacular celestial events. The upcoming April 8, 2024 solar eclipse will take a special path across the USA. This celestial event is a spectacle not to be missed and it's all about location, location, location. The path of totality, the narrow corridor where the moon will fully cover the sun begins in the Pacific Ocean and makes its first landfall in Mexico's Sinaloa state. It then continues its journey northeast, crossing into Texas. The cities of Waco and Dallas will be treated to a total solar eclipse, a rare sight indeed. The path then continues over Arkansas and Missouri, with the city of Springfield, in the path of totality. The eclipse then sweeps over Illinois, Indiana and Ohio, with Indianapolis and Dayton poised for an extraordinary show. The track continues over the northeastern states of New York, Vermont and New Hampshire. Even the city that never sleeps, New York City will catch a glimpse of this spectacular event. So, what does this mean for you? If you're located within this path, you'll have the opportunity to witness one of nature's most awe-inspiring shows, a total solar eclipse. But remember, even if you're outside the path of totality, you'll still experience a partial solar eclipse, a sight that's still well worth watching. As the great astronomer Carl Sagan once said, astronomy is a humbling and character-building experience. And there's no experience quite like a solar eclipse, where the moon, for a brief moment, takes center stage, leaving us in its shadow, and reminding us of our place in the grand cosmic theater. The path of the April 8, 2024 solar eclipse is a reminder of the wonders of our universe, a path that weaves across our nation, uniting us under an astronomical spectacle. So mark the date and prepare for this rare celestial spectacle. Remember, the universe doesn't operate on our schedule. So when it offers us a show, we'd be wise to sit back and enjoy it. Solar eclipses have fascinated humans for centuries, but they are more than just a spectacle. An eclipse is not simply a grand show put up by the cosmos, but it carries significant scientific and cultural implications. From a scientific perspective, solar eclipses have been instrumental in advancing our understanding of the universe. One of the most famous examples is the total solar eclipse of May 29, 1919. During this eclipse, Sir Arthur Eddington conducted an experiment to test Albert Einstein's then-revolutionary theory of general relativity. Eddington's observations of starlight bending around the sun, made possible by the darkness of the eclipse, provided the first empirical validation of Einstein's theory. It changed the course of modern physics. Beyond the realm of science, solar eclipses have held immense cultural significance across different civilizations. Ancient cultures often interpreted these celestial events as omens or divine messages. In many Native American tribes, an eclipse was seen as a time of reconciliation, a moment when the sun and the moon resolved their quarrels. In ancient China, it was believed that a celestial dragon was swallowing the sun, prompting loud drumming and noise-making to scare the dragon away and save the sun. Today, these cultural interpretations have evolved, but the fascination remains. Solar eclipses are now seen as unique opportunities for people across the world to come together, to witness and appreciate the beauty and mystery of our universe. They serve as reminders of our place in the cosmos, of how we are part of a larger, magnificent cosmic dance. As we anticipate the upcoming solar eclipse on April 8, 2024, we are not just preparing for a visual treat. We are getting ready to partake in a significant cosmic event that ties us to our past, shapes our understanding of the universe, and brings us together in shared wonder. 
Eclipses are not merely a marvel to behold, but a testament to the intricate dance of celestial bodies. The climax of a total solar eclipse, known as totality, is a truly awe-inspiring moment. Now imagine the scene, the sky darkens, the temperature drops, and the stars appear in the middle of the day. This is the magic of totality, the moment when the moon completely obscures the sun. A profound hush descends upon the world as if time itself has paused, and for a brief moment, day turns into night. During totality, the sun's outer atmosphere, the corona, becomes visible. It's an ethereal sight, a shimmering halo of light, and it's the only time we can see it with our naked eyes. The corona is hotter than the surface of the sun, and is a spectacular sight, a crown of plasma flowing outward into space. But the corona isn't the only spectacle during totality. The darkness of totality reveals what's usually hidden by daylight, the planets and the stars. Suddenly, Venus, Mars, and perhaps even Mercury become visible. It's a unique opportunity to experience the vastness of our universe. And if you're fortunate, you might witness Bailey's Beads, a phenomenon named after the British astronomer Francis Bailey. This happens just before and after totality when the moon's rugged terrain allows beads of sunlight to shine through. It's like a string of dazzling pearls around the moon's silhouette. Another phenomenon to look out for is the diamond ring effect. This happens just before totality and just after, when there's a single point of sunlight shining brightly. It's like a celestial jewel, a diamond ring in the sky. Witnessing totality is a deeply emotional experience. It's a reminder of our place in the universe, our connection to the cosmos. The world changes around us, and for a brief moment, we are part of something larger, something beyond our everyday lives. As Neil deGrasse Tyson once said, the universe is under no obligation to make sense to you, but it sure is fascinating. While a solar eclipse is visible from many places, some spots offer a superior viewing experience. Let's embark on a virtual journey to the best locations in the United States to witness the upcoming grand spectacle of the solar eclipse on April 8, 2024. Starting from the Lone Star State, Texas, where the path of totality first touches the U.S. soil. The city of Dallas, with its clear April skies, is a prime spot for eclipse enthusiasts to gather and witness this celestial event. Moving northeast, we reach Arkansas. The city of Little Rock, with its vast open spaces and parks, provides an ideal setting for a picnic under the shadow of the moon. Next, we visit the home of blues and birthplace of rock and roll Tennessee. The city of Nashville, with its vibrant music scene, will experience an eclipse duration of over four minutes, making it a must-visit spot for the event. As we continue our journey northeast, we visit Kentucky, the bluegrass state. Here, the city of Louisville, known for its horse racing and bourbon, will provide a unique backdrop to the cosmic event. From there, we travel to the heart of the Midwest. In Indiana, the city of Indianapolis, with its iconic motor speedway, will witness over four minutes of totality, offering a thrilling experience for eclipse watchers. Our journey then takes us to the Great Lakes region, Ohio, with its rich history and picturesque landscapes, will be an excellent host for the eclipse. The city of Cleveland, with its rock and roll hall of fame, is another prime spot to experience the event. Finally, we reach the Empire State New York. The city of Buffalo, with its stunning architecture and vibrant art scene, offers a unique and engaging environment to experience the eclipse. As the American astrophysicist Neil deGrasse Tyson once said, we are part of this universe. We are in this universe, but perhaps more important than both of those facts is that the universe is in us. So as we await this cosmic spectacle, let's remember that we are not just spectators, but part of this grand cosmic drama. Wherever you are, remember to look up and marvel at the grandeur of the cosmos on April 8, 2024.